What's up guys, I have with me right here a retail display box of 2022 Topps Heritage. So let's get right into this. So I don't believe there are any guaranteed hits with these, um, but given that it's a retail display box, I'm assuming all of the pack odds are likely the same as if you were just buying uh, single packs from any retail provider of tops. Let's get this baby open. There we go. I like the design on this year's Heritage. So... Let's get into this pack one. Just pull them up real quick here. So yeah, I don't know if this will get picked up here, but I'm pretty sure the odds are all the same as if you were just buying uh, Heritage Retail. Let's see what we got here. So it's eight cards a pack, or I forget how many. I think this is, let's see. 24 packs, 8 cards per pack. Nico Horner, Swanson, Dylan Moore, Lewis Brinson, Jay Cronenworth, I like him. Anthony Alford, Josiah Gray, New Age Performers, we'll put that to the side. Shane Bieber, Kevin Pillar. Try to keep the rookies in. If we hit any SPs, I'll put those separately. There we go. All right. That one's got a weird... I don't know if the camera can pick that up. It's got kind of a weird print line there. Dallas Keuchel. I'm glad to see he's gone. Jacob deGrom... Reese Hoskins, Trevor Rogers, Colton Wong, Tyler O'Neill. He's on my fantasy baseball team this year, and he's having kind of a tough season. Larry Garcia, Tony La Russa's favorite player. Speaking of guys I'd like to see gone from the Sox. All right, Jeff McNeil. Austin Meadows, he's now a Tiger. Buster Posey, home run leaders. Raphael Devers, this guy is very underrated in the hobby. Another guy on my fantasy baseball team, but he is just crushing it this year. Although I think he's on the IL right now. New Age Performers, Brandon Marsh. Manuel Margot, Chris Flexen. That one did not want to open. All right. Adam Duvall, Gavin Sheets, put that in the White Sox PC. Dustin May, Dylan Carlson, Jake Fraley, and it looks like we have. Is that some sort of sh SP variation? Let's see. It's not numbered. But it was backwards in the pack. Interesting. Manuel Rivera. Nick Solak. James Caprillion, Trent Grisham, Mike Soroka, Park, put that to the side, Elvis Andrews, Tyler Gilbert, the new Mariner, 
Luis Castillo, Miguel Rojas, Corbin Burns. You know, I really think, now that the Sox are kind of like just completely out of it, I really want the Mariners to go far, man. They're a really fun young team. Josh Rojas, Sonny Gray, Dom Smith, Jordan Alvarez, Bryce Harper, Rosario Card, Chris Stratton. This is another one that's turned backwards. Um, what is different about these? I know some of these heritage um, variations are very hard to notice. I'm not really sure. Put that one back here, though. Shamanaya. Kevin Gosman, Jared Walsh, Sandy Alcantara. He's also very underrated. Griffin Jacks, O'Neill Cruz. That's pretty nice. I'll put that to the side and sleeve that in a second. Max Freed. Here's another one of those insert sets that's kind of interesting. I know some people hate these. I kind of like them as someone who's kind of into history, but I could see why someone is a little bit turned off by these. Roldis Chapman, Shane Boz. It's a pretty nice rookie. All oh, these are tearing weird. Okay. Byron Buxton. Why are all of these backwards? Is this, uh,. Why were all these backwards? It's a little weird. Put the alloy, huh? Put the alloy in the white socks. I don't know why these are all turned backwards. This is weird. Got a lot of these are I don't know why these, why, maybe the Buxton was just turned backwards, but that was weird. I guess Giolito, he's having a tough year, but man, I, I, I love Gio, even if it is kind of a bad year for him. Faro, this man's got a cannon, Steven Matz, DJ Peters, yeah, is another Sox player having a really tough year, just can't stay healthy, and when he is healthy, he just kind of doesn't look 100%, Jesse Winker, also a Mariner now, Luis Roberts, Tristan McKenzie, Jake McGee, Jesus Aguilar, Not much so far, other than the uh, O'Neill Cruz. Oh man, these are tearing just really badly. There we go. Mason Thompson, Hyunjin Ryu, Bo Bichette, Tero Strada, Charlie Morton. This guy's still in the league. He's got to be like. 40 almost. Robbie Ray, another Mariner I like. Nick Madrigal, you know, even though he's having a tough year, I miss this guy in a Sox uniform. I do. That that at the time it made sense to to trade for Kimbrel, but man, if if we could have hindsight with that trade, I would have undone it in a heartbeat. Okay, Jordan Montgomery, Jose Siri, Roberto Clemente. It's a nice looking card. 
Altuve, yuck. Dalton Varsho, Kevin Biggio, the son of Craig Biggio. Trish Speaker, all-time doubles leader. Gene Segura, Tyler Anderson. I think this is about the halfway point. There we go. Jesus Lazardo. I remember I used to pull him all the time when he was on the A's before he got traded. Matt Barnes, Sensatella, Alex Dickerson, David Fletcher. Some sort of variation. Sergio Alcantara. I'm going to guess that's some sort of variation. 2021 strikeouts, or sorry, rookie outfielders leader. Can't read today, apparently. James McCann. I also miss him in a Sox uniform, even though he hasn't been great since he left. Guess he can't be doing much worse than Grandal right now. Darno, Steven Piscotti, Andrew Vaughn. There we go. It's a nice socks. It's even though it's not his rookie card. Still like the look of it. Kyle Hendricks, Luis Frias, New Age Performers, Julio Rios, Manuel Rodriguez, and Vladdy Jr. I do not like to tear easily. All right. Christian Vasquez just got traded. Ryan Presley. Romy Gonzalez. I didn't know he was in this set. That's pretty nice. I like that. Taiwan Walker. Colton Welker. Another Rafael Devers. Rafael Ortega. Glaber Torres. Jonathan India. He's another underrated guy, even though he did win Rookie of the Year. Nathan Avaldi, Rookie Pitchers, Zach Plezak, Tommy Edmond. That card's really off center. I don't know if you can see that or if the camera picks that up. Uh, Cedric Mullins, Eric Lauer, and Wilmer Flores. Man, I was hoping we'd at least hit one wander. Oh, there we go. Speak of the devil. <laughs> right after I said that, I will put him to the side. 2021 batting leaders, Brandon Marsh, Eric Hosmer, Kevin Newman, Reyes, Hans Kraus, Tyler Meagill. Does he have a rookie in flagship yet? I think he does. Another one of those good underrated uh, Mets pitchers, I feel like. Even though they have already have Scherzer and DeGrom, if they could just stay healthy. All right. Tyler Wade. Bregman, Brandon Rogers, McCullers, Ricky Pitchers, Phil Goslin, Miguel Andahar. Yeah, I don't know what's different about these or why they're turned backwards. They're not numbered. I'll have to look into that later. 
Brian De La Cruz, Francisco Lindor. Andrew Benintendi, the new Yankee. That team just keeps getting better, man. Evan Longoria, Jed Lowry, CJ Crone, Rodolfo Castro. There's another one. Wilson Ramos. Ken, that one was turned backwards. Adolis Garcia, another underrated guy. Dawson, that's a rookie. Justin Upton, he's no longer with the Angels. Josh Naylor, this guy kills the Sox every time we play him now. Kenley Jansen, Miggy, Juan Soto. That hasn't aged well now that he's on the Pirates. Lou Brock and Trey Turner. Walk-off single of Austin Riley and Ernie Clements. Melanson, I remember when he was on Pittsburgh for the longest time. Ryan Zimmerman, I'm glad he got a ring before he retired. I always liked Ryan Zimmerman. Teoscar Hernandez, Victor Robles, Pete Alonzo. I love Pete Alonzo. Interesting card to have in this set. Alberto Mondesi, Devin Williams. This guy's got a nasty change. any big hits in this display box. So another one where the cards are kind of turned in a weird way it looked like. Ramirez, another guy that always kills the Sox. Nick Pavetta, Miles Straw, there's another one. Avi Garcia, Dansby Swanson, Jake Rizzi, Anthony Santander, Kike Hernandez, and Anthony DiSclafani. Big yet. All right. Sander Bogarts, Josh Lowe, Sandy Alcantara again, Griffin Jacks again, Anthony Santander again. Brian Goodwin. Oh, got a Joe Ryan autograph. This is interesting. I was not expecting that. We got ourselves an auto in here. Let me go ahead and uh, sleeve that baby up. So I man manifested the Wander rookie card, and now we got ourselves a Joe Ryan rookie auto. That's pretty nice. I like that. And the last two were Brandon Woodruff and Didi Gregorius. So that was the third to last pack, and it had the best card out of there. That's pretty nice, can't complain with that. Nice rookie auto, even though it is a pitcher on a team I dislike. Chris Taylor, Ozzy Albee is another underrated guy. John Lester, Corey Dickerson, Brian Goodwin again. I was actually at the game that this uh, picture was taken in. Um, I remember it was a two to one game uh, in the ninth inning and Brian Goodwin came up uh, after committing a base running error earlier in the game and hit a walk-off solo homer and pimp the bat flip on this card. I'll never forget that game. 
Oh, got an Adam Engel card turned backwards. Guessing that's some sort of variation it looks like, but unnumbered again. Pretty nice. Brian Hayes, Joe Barlow. Hayward, Luis Torrens, who I believe just got DFA'd. I see some kind of color in this pack behind this. Emmanuel Classe, Pavin Smith. I'm actually going to put that one to the side. I think I know who this is, but I want to save it. So we got Ryan Stanick. Dylan Cease. Damn, there's a lot of socks in these last two packs. I like this. Lourdes Guriel, so we got Pavin Smith. Yep, I know exactly who this is. This is Luis Robert. All right, I like that. This is an awesome looking card. What's it numbered to? Let's see, 573, I like that. This is in really good condition too. It looks like very well centered. I like the color on that. Very well centered. Edges look good. Corners look pretty good. No whiting on the back, which is usually what gets these cards with these uh, black borders on the, the background. But yeah, that looks really good. I like that. These last uh, couple packs have been very good. Get that in there. All right, that's a very nice looking card. I like that, especially knowing that it's Luis Robert. And that was our last pack too. Thought I, I thought we had one more, but I guess we did not. But you know what? I can't complain with that. That was uh, some good PC stuff in that pack. And then we also got uh, the two big rookies, I guess, out of this, out of what is in um, 2022 Heritage, non-high number until they start adding those extra guys in there. Uh, but we got one O'Neill Cruz. We got ourselves a Wander. I like that. It'll look really good next to the uh, short print I have back here um, from Series 1. And then we got ourselves a nice PC card here of Luis Robert. I think that's, yeah, it's on the top loader. That little mark right there, it's not on the card. Uh, but that looks really nice and numbered to 573. And then before that, we got ourselves a Joe Ryan Rookie Auto. This is a blue ink one, but still, that's pretty nice. I like the look of that. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little uh, rip with our Topps 2022 Heritage uh, retail display box. Um, and have a good one.